Welcome back YouTube! Today, screen paint for the projector screen. What the hell else would I paint? These are the only tools you're going to need for the entire job. You're going to need some tape. I've found so far pinning this basement, this frog tape is amazing. So we got that. Bear Premium Paint. That is the code for that one. That is the code for that one. And that's the code for that one. You're going to need a stick. Stir it up in your bucket. You're going to need a big ass roller. You're going to need a little roller. It's a poly. Lay it down so it doesn't mess up your carpet. Oh, and you're going to need a tray because, well, how the hell are you going to roll the paint? Sorry, I missed a step. All right, so let's get on with it. First, you're going to need the instructions, or as we like to say around the house, distractions. So the distractions are, and I took a picture of it, just to make sure that everybody would know exactly what it is. So this guy right here, you're going to use half of the gallon. Half of it. Uh, five eighths, none of that, just, just half the gallon. Do your best. Nobody here is a rocket scientist. Well, maybe you are. I don't know. Anyway, uh, uh, the eight ounce dark pewter, you're going to add the whole thing. So, there we go. And then you're going to use uh, one quarter of the black, so that way... Well, now we know everything we're going to use, so let's shake it up, figure it out. So, bear, dark pewter. Get this puppy in here. Make it easy. Whee! Okay, close enough. So, set that off to the side. Next said use a quart of this. One quarter. Woo! <laughs> that is black. Okay, now we're going to put in a quarter of the black. Do we can do this without screwing up. There you go. That looks like a quarter to me. I'm going to put that right there because I'm going to walk on that spot and I know knowing me I'll probably get my feet all over it. Now it says to use half of this big boy right here. Da, 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 da. Really excited about this. Okay, half. There's half. All right. Shit. It's slippery. <laughs> okay, so here we go. We got the paint all stirred up. Threw it in here. And... The moment that I have been waiting on. I'm really excited. Let's get it going. Okay, so first coat done. Almost. Center speaker, gotta get that part. Second thing, I'm a dumbass. Painted the ceiling. It's okay. Still have some ceiling paint, thanks to my buddy who builds houses all the time. I 
don't screw up that much, but when I do, it's magnificent. Anyway, we're going to let this dry. I'm going to show you what it looks like with the first coat. I think I'm going to do two, maybe three. We'll see how much paint's left. And uh, yeah, we'll see if the layer effect gives it a better look or if it actually makes it worse. I don't know. Let's try it out. All right, here, let's let this dry and we'll come right back to you. Okay, it's been about an hour. Paint doesn't take that long to dry, but coffee break, food, I'm fat. I needed to get it in me. So, second coat. By the way, the black's definitely coming out a lot nicer. By the way, for those of you that are not professional painters like myself, and you're wondering why I'm going back and forth a couple times, a buddy of mine, Paulo, told me there's something called back rolling. It helps get rid of the lines in your paint because your paint roller is going to have some heavy sides and some light sides, <coughs> and it just keeps help thinning it out. I'm not putting a tremendous amount of pressure. I'm just putting a little. And uh, I like using this broom handle because it seems to keep the paint flowing on the board or the wall rather uh, a lot smoother then you're getting up close. All right, everybody, that's a wrap. We are painted. I did three coats, three, because, well, that's all the paint there was. I was gonna keep going, but anyway, <laughs> it looks awesome. And uh, let me show you what it looks like now. The, the color is amazing. Uh, kind of taking a long time for this video to come out because, well, uh, I get excited. I got ADHD. What the hell do you want? Anyway, I've been watching the F1 races. Uh, just phenomenal colors. You feel like you're actually there. It's fantastic. Anyway, sorry, rambling. Movie. Here we go. <laughs> Don't forget to hit the like button down below if you like what you saw today. Okay, while this thing is paused, because, well, it hates me whenever I try to stream, I'm going to show you guys something. Look at that. That's me just sitting right next to the screen. Look at the blocks. Look at the color. Like, they say you need to go and get the fancy screens, and maybe you do. Maybe it'll give it more of a beautiful color, but if you're building and you want to do something like this, it's uh it's pretty damn good for for my opinion here look at this like that's that's cool i like it a lot so to briefly walk you around the finished product we've got background lighting led it's pretty badass i love it i got them hidden in there built all the way up we did the picture frame Mited out some 45s, it's awesome, and painted it black so that way when you come down and you walk in, that's what you see. Just that simplicity, everything's hidden, everything's looking, well, exactly like I want. So the more astute of you are going to wonder where the hell are those fancy expensive speakers that were supposed to go right here. And there was going to be a big box one right there, there. There was going to be one right around there, down there, there, there. I think there was something in here. And then two subwoofers. Well, to be honest with you, I ran out of money. <laughs> I, uh, I budgeted a certain amount for this basement, and boy, was I wrong. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to save up. Now, with that being said, any of you speaker people, y'all want to hit me up with some in-wall speakers, let me know. I would love it. Yeah. What? <laughs> 
we're all done. I want to say thank you so much for watching as always. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And if you like what you saw today, hit the old subscribe button. And uh, yeah, you'll get to stay current with all the new videos that we're releasing. We're going to have a bunch of new content coming out. It's going to be uh, automotive related mostly. It's going to be in the way of... Well, new products. What's new? What's hot? What's coming out that uh, actually helps? I don't like reviewing things that don't help. It's just, to me, it's pointless. So, there you go. Anyway, again, thanks. Have a great day. We'll see you next time.